<laughs> drinking out of my hocus pocus mug if your name is justin stop watching this vlog i appreciate it i do but stop watching thank you welcome back to the vlog welcome to the first video in my wedding series this is gonna be a very long series because it's a very long engagement, which is fun. So it's like never ending. Today, I am going to try on some dresses. Put my tea down. With my two best friends, we're going to this place in Venice called Grace Loves Lace. Do I love lace? Not really. I am like 99% sure I am not gonna find my dress here. When I first started looking at wedding dresses online when we got engaged, I was kind of going for more of like a minimalistic, open back, long, silky dress. Super simple. But now that I've done more research, I know more of what I want. It's a little more something something. And if I can put this on the screen, this is kind of the vibe that I'm going for. And I'm not gonna be happy until I get it, to be honest. This is one thing that I'm going to be extremely picky about when it comes to wedding planning. If I don't feel 110% in the dress that I'm wearing, it's not gonna be a good day. Wedding is canceled. But yeah, we will see what happens. I'm gonna take you along with me. I'm gonna have my friends vlog for me while I'm trying on dresses today and you will get to see what I like and what I don't like and if there are any winners, which there probably won't be. Quick outfit. I thought I heard a door close downstairs. Well, I know I heard a door close and I'm home alone, so I'm gonna go. But first, quick outfit of the day. I am wearing this little necklace from Urban Outfitters little hoops, this corset from, oh man, you can't even see it. This corset top from White Fox. And then you kind of can't see my skirt, but I'm wearing this like midi skirt with a high slit. I'm falling off this chair. We're gonna get going. I'm already running late, as always. <laughs>
just went and tried on wedding dresses. Well, not all of us. Oh, I tried on wedding all? dresses. I will say this is not where I'm getting my dress. There's like three that I really like, but it's just not it. And the girl was standing there the whole time and it was making me nervous. So I said I like them more than I do, but I'm probably not gonna end up getting any of these. I have another appointment next week. So I'm gonna try on more and we will see, but I do have a year and a half. So, but I will update you when we're doing something more fun. Well, it is two days later from when I last talked to you guys. My voice is semi gone. Yesterday I didn't vlog literally at all because it was fully gone. I had like a cough the day that I went to go try on dresses and then I was with my two best friends and we were screaming and laughing and talking. So it was just not a good situation for my voice. But now it is going back to normal slowly, but this is what we have to deal with for now. But today I had a shoot with my friend Chris. We have shot together like four or five times now, I can't remember. But every couple months we just meet up and we do like a shoot just for our portfolios. But it's super fun. He's like an amazing photographer. I'll put his little at here so you can follow him and see all of his work. We went to this loft in downtown LA and just shot for like an hour and a half. And now I am starving as always. And I need coffee because I have a migraine. So I am going to this place called Tilt coffee bar. I'm gonna get there before they close because I think they close in like an hour. So yeah, I need my time to sit down, think about life, write in my book, go on my phone, what have you. So yeah, I will update you when I have coffee. This is so good. I got an oat milk latte, got it with coconut cream, which is like cold foam with coconut instead of regular milk. This is the best thing I've ever had. Maybe it's because I haven't had coffee in two days, but this is amazing. But I'm gonna sit here and submit for some things because I haven't done that in like two weeks. And I'm gonna do some wedding planning stuff. So you can watch me do that. <laughs> and drink this latte. going to see the Batman with Justin. I have been waiting a very long time to see it and I think I'm gonna love it, so. Oh, I see you. <laughs> Hopefully no cops watch my YouTube channel. I didn't do any wedding planning stuff, but honestly my brain is like fried from wedding planning. Like I've been doing so much research just about like what I want, what I like, decor, 
checklists, like things that I need, timelines. And I'm like, don't I have a wedding planner to do all this stuff for me? Like, I'm sorry, this is a lot. I have so much to do. But right now, I feel like I'm comfortable with just getting inspo. Finding things on Pinterest, finding things that I like, deciding what I want so that when I get vendors and stuff, I can just tell them what I need and what I want and how much of it. It's taking me so long to plan everything because one, I am so indecisive. So that's a great start. Two, I want to find the cheapest of everything and the best of everything at the same time. And I also think I want to DIY a lot of things like decor, stuff that goes on tables, invitations, because I just don't want to spend a ton of money on that stuff. So probably going to end up making a lot of stuff myself, which I like. I'm crafty, as one would say about me. But yeah, what I'm most concerned with right now is finding a good venue and finding the dress that I want. I have a long time, but I want to like walk it in right now. There's so much to think about. I'm like, I don't know why it makes me nervous. You ever have those nightmares where you're like unprepared for a test? You're like walking in for a test and you have to take it. I have nightmares like that all the time. You're like going on stage to do like a performance or something or give a speech and you're not prepared and you have to do it. And it's like the most like embarrassing thing of your life. I feel like this is that, but like divided by a hundred, like not that intense, but like it gives me that same feeling. Like I am unprepared, but we literally have like 15 months until the wedding. So I don't know, but if you have any good suggestions for places I can find a dress, good venues, but you know, any tips and tricks, please let me know because I need all the help I can get right now. I will keep you in the loop. Every step of the way, you will be here with me. We're in this together. This is our wedding. You and me, well, it's me and Justin, but you will also be there. Maybe, some of you are invited, but you don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna stop talking. Okay, goodbye. Well, 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 look who it is, it's me. I am not getting better at this. I forgot to end this vlog again. I'm currently editing it and I need an outro. So this is the entire purpose of this video. But I hope you enjoyed this. More wedding planning videos to come. There's so much more I have to do, but it's fun, it's exciting. So I'm glad that I can document it while I'm doing it so I can look back at this you know, later in my life and see how stressed out I was. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you have any ideas for what I could vlog in the future, content that you would like to see. Go ahead and let me know. Drop it down in those comments down there. Um, yeah, it is, I'm not gonna lie, it's not the next day. It is much, much later from the last clip I filmed. It's probably like two to three weeks later. We had a move. We had a lot of things going on, which you will also see later. But thank you again so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. I'm in Justin's room right now. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Bye.